This is part three of Painting Dark Skin. So far we've been working on this African-American woman and you can see that her skin is very red. Her skin is so red because of the artificial lighting that the photographer is using. If this woman was outside, her skin would appear more blue. In other words, her skin would be reflecting some of the sky like these children here. So I'm going to do another video that features this skin that has more of a blue tone to it. And you can see that this is natural light. These children are outside. And look at the blue reflection from the sky on top of his head and on his right side of his face. It's interesting to see how the pink shirt influences the reflection on his left side of his face. You can see the pink lines on his left side of his face. And also that side of his face turns much redder because it's away from the sun. And it's also reflecting some of the ground and his pink shirt. So you can see the red is always there on dark-skinned people. So we'll move back to our original model and just keep in mind that she has artificial light on her and not natural light from outside. I purposely kept the red and the yellow down on this because I know that it's artificial light. I'll just continue to merge these edges together. Skin is very smooth. So the edges are very soft. There's a lot of different ways to do this, but this is the way I do it. So really I'm not picking up any more paint right now. I'm just merging edges together with my soft sable brush. So now here at the end, I'm just cleaning up some of the areas that need to be filled in. I've got all my edges just about how I want them. Of course, I do these paintings within 30 minutes. I spend more time on my paintings in my studio. I create these videos fairly fast because I just want to show you the basic strategies for capturing these images. So I spend a little less time on videos than I would in my studio. So I hope this helps you learn how to paint dark skin. Either get a live model or a good photo and practice with these simple colors that we're using. And remember, I'll be doing another video on dark skin and we'll lean our colors more toward the blue side rather than this red side. So we'll look forward to that in the coming weeks.